All right, I'm going to do this first one using the FOIL method so you can see why these types are special types, what, what you get as a result. Let's do the first times the first, b times b, b squared. Then let's do the outer, b times negative 6, negative 6, b. Then let's do the inner, positive 6 times v, positive 6, v. And then let's do the last, 6 times negative 6, negative 36. And what you can see is that these two terms are exact opposites and they cancel out, leaving you with simply b squared minus 36. And then so what is the shortcut for this? The shortcut is this. When you have, and let me erase what we have there. So it's not in your way. When you have two binomials, and they look exactly like they have essentially, they've got this same term in the front, and then they've got this same term in the back, but with different signs in between them, then you get this special case where you can, let me erase that, those marks, where you can just square the number in the front, b squared, square the number in the back, 6 times 6, 36, and then put a uh, negative to subtract in between them, v squared minus 36. Okay, so let's speed that up here. You can see that this is one of those special cases. Looks exactly the same, but with a different sign in between. So we're going to square this, z squared. We're going to square this, 25, and we're going to put a subtraction in between them. That's the quick trick. We're going to do it one more time, okay? Down here on the bottom. We're going to square this, 100. We're going to square this, y squared. And we're going to subtract in between them. That's how you do it. Those are super fast, and that's why we want you to know that it's a special case, because you can quickly move to the answer. And you 